Here we're given three points A, B and C, the vertices of a triangle, given their coordinates, and we're asked to find the equation of the median through C. So first thing we must do is create a good working diagram. So A is the point negative 3, 5. B is 7, 9, and C is the point 2, 11. So here we have our triangle A, B, C. The equation of the median through C would be the line from C to the midpoint, let's call it M, of the opposite side of the triangle. So M is the midpoint of AB. So we'll really need to find the coordinates of that point. So let's explain what that is. Let M be the midpoint of AB. Then M will be, so we take the average of the x-coordinates, the mean of the two x-coordinates, that's negative 3 plus 7 divided by 2, and we take the mean of the two y-coordinates, that's 5 plus 9 over 2. And that works out at 3 from 7 is 4, 4 divided by 2 is 2. 5 plus 9 is 14, divided by 2 is 7. So M is the point 2, 7. Let's add it to our working diagram. So what we're asked to find is the equation of the median through C. Now the first thing I notice here is that this line passes through the point 2, 11, and the point 2, 7. So it has x coordinates of these two points are both 2. In other words, this line is parallel to the y axis, and every single point on this line will have an x coordinate of 2. We're done. That is the equation of the line. So the equation of the median. through C is x equals 2. And in brackets we can put it as parallel to the y-axis. Now if you hadn't noticed that and you decided you wanted to work out the gradient of the line joining M to C, and you do the Y difference, say 11 minus 7 over the X difference, 2 minus 2, you would end up with um, 4 over 0. And that's undefined. We can't divide uh, any numbers by 0. So it's the only line that has no gradient, a vertical line, if you like, a line parallel to the Y axis. So if you hadn't known that, by this time, if you tried to work out the gradient using the gradient formula, uh, you would have got into great difficulty, and you might then have gone back and said, ah, oh, no, that's what's gone wrong. It's parallel to the y-axis. So the equation is of, of a special form. It's x equals 2. Every point on that line has an x-coordinate of 2, and that's what the equation is telling you. x equals 2.